Hello my people, I'm back from California, sitting here with the pool, it's so nice, sun is shining, life is good. Um, today I want to talk about, again, how to understand our new identity in Christ Jesus. Because Jesus, he did not only save us from eternal death to a life with him in eternity where we got saved but he also made everything accomplished so that we could live a life here on this planet made whole in our souls he made everything new and he wants you to see that he has set a table before you with healing, restoration, yes, even from trauma. That's what I want to talk about today a little bit. Trauma. Because trauma, what is trauma? It is when you have a very bad, hurtful experience and it kind of sticks with you and it goes into your physical body too. Some of the sicknesses that we are carrying are actually caused by trauma. Because even if your soul tries to forget old hurts, old bad situations that you went through, abuse, I don't know, rejection, a lot of heavy hurts, abandonment, it's many things that become a trauma because if it's so heavy when you're little, what you experience, you carry that in your future. You carry it with you, it shapes you. A trauma shapes a person. It shapes the way you think about yourself. Uh, it shapes the way uh, you feel. And, and, and for example, if you have a trauma about rejection from your childhood, you will see life through the eyes of rejection all the time. Even if you are not that rejected as you believe, you will feel rejected because you're in your trauma. And the enemy, he loves that we are in our trauma. He loves that we are not healed from our past wounds. And he loves that we keep up the old pattern of hurts, that we are stuck in our fears. So he wants us to not see the cross. He, wa he, want us to hi he wants to hide, he can't hide it, but he wants us to not understand how much Jesus has actually done for us. He has broken the, the trauma in every one of our lives. He has broken down everything that hurt us physically. You see, God wants to heal your trauma today. He wants to heal everything you suffer through this life. Even if you're saved, you go to church, you know you're gonna to go to heaven, and you even, maybe you're in your calling. Maybe you're preaching, maybe you're praying for other people to be healed. And it works too, because you're operating from a gift. A gift that God gave you by grace. And you maybe study the word of God, you know a lot of scriptures, you know exactly what to do for other people. But then your life is miserable. You have still a lot of issues in your soul that haven't been dealt with because you haven't understood or taken in that Jesus, he wants to make everything in you whole. Not only save your soul from hell, but he, his package, what he comes with when he said it is finished, it is accomplished, it is done. He meant everything. He meant our bodies and he meant our soul, people. So our bodies can walk around in this life carrying a lot of trauma and pain. And it's so unnecessarily because God has saved us and he healed us from that through Jesus Christ. He wants us to see it. He wants us to see what we carry on the inside. One thing that healed me from fear, for example, is when I started to realize 
that Jesus is my safe place all the time because he lives, he dwells in me. He has taken his, he has his little apartment here in my heart. He lives inside of me 24 seven. So I'm never alone and I'm, I don't have any reason to be fear, fearful because I'm in a safe place all the time because I'm with him. I'm in him and he is living inside of me and he wants to come through in all the areas of our lives. He wants us to be healed from all hurts and brokenness. He wants us to see that he had made us whole people. Yeah. He was us, wants us to understand that we don't have to carry a sick body as a Christian. We can be made whole. We are made whole through the cross, but we need to see it and we need to take it and make it to a reality for us and step into it by faith. Everything is about faith. Everything is about having a revelation about what Christ has given us here on this planet. He made everything. He finished it for us. So you are not only walking around as a Christian person, but you are like um, hurting, you are depressed, you have fear, you have pain in your body. You see, when God says that all life has passed away, it doesn't exist anymore. You should not have anything from your old life uh, torturing you today because that chapter is, is, is closed. Your old life is dead, doesn't exist anymore. You have to step out into your new life with Christ where you are a new person, a new creation in him. It doesn't mean that you only are a new, that your spirit is being reborn, but it means that your whole being is being made new. Your cells, everything in your body from your past should be renewed because of Christ on the inside of you and all your hurts in your emotional life all your sufferings, your low self-esteem. Why do you have low self-esteem when Christ lives inside of you? The King of Kings is living inside of you and you still feel fear and you still feel that you don't measure up because you're living in your old life and you need to stop thinking like that. You have to live in your new creation that is in Christ Jesus. So this is my word today and the sun is shining in California. I'm happy. Have a beautiful day. God bless you people. Amen.